as the Optimus 3D. Um, so let's go ahead and, and, and show something. Like I said, we may run out of juice during this, but it's running Android 2.2. Um, it's got a 4.3 inch screen. This is actually in camera mode, which um, you can't really tell, but um, I'm trying to get to a, get to a game before we um, before we lose battery juice here, going back to the 3D space. All right, so here we are. Um, so when you get a 3D space, even the menus are in 3D. Um, a couple games on here that are that are preloaded on this demo version. Um, but what we saw the camera earlier. What I want to mention about that is, you know, you've got the option to shoot 3D stills and video. Um, 720 on the uh, on the on the 3D video capture. So. And, and I think it's from the AV picture. Uh, it's a five megapixel camera. So yeah, but, um, but how many megapixels for three D pictures? Oh, it's a good question. I don't know I offhand. Think two megapixels. Right? Yeah, maybe it might be. Um, so anyway, there's this little golf game on here, uh, which we've shown a couple times today. It's going to take a little while for some of the menus to load. And, um, but one of the other things the device has, which uh, isn't up and running right now, is uh, YouTube 3D. So I've been. Oh, yeah, I think our battery just died on us. <laughs> That's not good. Oh, we might be back. Yeah, let's see if it wakes up. Just one delay. But um, like I said, with with with, with YouTube 3D. And having a 3D phone, a 3D camera in your pocket, I mean, you know, they might be out there, but a lot of people aren't saying, I want a 3D camera right now. Not a, excuse me, not a lot of options right now. Um, so we just go through these menus. You can see even in the menus when you're in real life, these, it's even 3D, you know, this um, developer's done a really cool job of, of adding 3D content. Um, but the, the power of having a bunch of people with 3D cameras and, and, and com combine YouTube 3D, it's going to add an added development to, uh, to to people adopting and wanting 3D beyond just these really cool games that developers are going to build. Okay. Are there so. any differences between that one and the Optimus 3D? There, there, there'll be, I'm sure, some small things. Where it's still early on for us, you know, so... Um, we we said this device will be out in the coming months, um, just because we're not real we're not real close on timing it. So anyway, as you're you know, for instance, in this game, if you're, it's going to be hard to see obviously on this video, but um, the things that are that you see in 3D, the 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 thing there in the foreground, the 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 white line where for the ball trajectory, all appears to be to be 3D on the screen, and so you really kind of uh, get a sense of what 3D gaming could be like. And and honestly, the the best kind of the a sweet spot for holding it. It's like as you were gaming, so probably about 18 inches to two feet away. You know, you know, holding it as if you were you were playing a game. But really, really exciting and um, a real first for us. So. Awesome.